All right, so in this problem, we need to get x by itself first. So we need to solve this. So first, I'm going to need to distribute this negative 3. So I get negative 3 times x is negative 3x. Negative 3 times 4 is a negative 12. I still have plus 2 is greater than or equal to 7 minus x. Then I'm going to combine my like terms here first. So I get negative 3x. A negative 12, a positive 2, gives me a negative 10, which is greater than or equal to 7 minus x. Okay, again, I need to get my x's together, so I'm going to move this negative x. So for me to move it, I'm going to add x on both sides. So a negative 3x and a positive 1x gives me a negative 2x. I still have minus 10 is greater than or equal to 7. Okay, then I need to move this 10, so it's a minus 10, so I'm going to add 10 to both sides. Therefore, we get negative 2x is greater than or equal to 17. And lastly, I'm going to divide by negative 2, and I'm not going to forget I'm dividing by a negative, so I need to flip that sign, and I'm going to leave it as a fraction here, negative 17 over 2. So then I'm going to make my number line here, negative 17 over 2. And we're going to use a bracket, and it says x is less than or equal to. So bracket, less than or equal to, so we're going to the left. Set notation, we're going from negative infinity, we're going to negative 17 over 2 with a bracket.